is up youtube it is your girl nasiani back at it again with the episode and you're watching my channel so without further ado let's just hop right into this video so today i'm going to be doing a follow-up to the melanin hair care line i did a video on this product maybe a year or two a while ago i made a video on the product where i reviewed the whole line which was the conditioner the shampoo the elongating styling cream and then the oil i've been using it for pretty much all this time and i just want to give an updated review as well as a review of the brand new product that launched last year which is the plumping deep conditioner this product right here so first we're gonna go into this i love this product i'll use this when i wash my hair and i've been using it as you can see i love this product it made my hair feel so soft it made my hair feel so silky it made my hair feel so hydrated my hair felt amazing and to be quite honest going back to the initial line i remember when i used the deep conditioner it made my hair feel quite dry and i didn't really like the way it felt so i th got rid of the conditioner but this deep plumping conditioner the only thing is that it is super expensive so if you already have a product that is working for you if you are unable to splurge on a product that is a little bit more pricey i understand that but if you do have you know a little extra money to treat yourself i definitely would recommend this product i quite like it i love this pro i don't know if i'm saying it too much or not enough i don't know this product made my hair feel amazing feel great and honestly i would repurchase this because i just like the way it makes my hair feel so let's go and recap on the other products that we went through the oil i repurchased it a few times it's completely finished right now i don't even have a bottle to show you because i finished the product and i've repurchased it a few times usually i wait for when it's on sale to repurchase it or get a few and stock up and then just go through those bottles but i love the oil i've actually never repurchased the elongating style cream this is actually the same exact bottle that was in the original video that i filmed a few years ago so as you can see i haven't really used it a lot i've used it a few times or i use it sometimes but i'm not i haven't really got i don't really like it's not my favorite product but it's all it's an okay product but for full price i don't know however the shampoo i actually quite like as you can see it's almost finished and i like the shampoo i would rebuy it it's not something that i would like go out of my way to get you know what i mean but it's a good shampoo so if you want a good shampoo i love the applicator i love how it's easy to get in between the crevices and really get into your scalp i think that the design is really thoughtful and i really like the shampoo and then the conditioner i never repurchased it i actually got rid of it because i just didn't like the way my hair felt with the conditioner and i think those are all the products oil loved the original conditioner didn't like so much um the elongated style cream okay but i wouldn't repurchase it again shampoo really like it and i would repurchase it again the deep plumping conditioner my favorite 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 product that i've ever purchased from this line alongside the oil those are pretty much my thoughts my comprehensive review on the whole melanin hair care line if you've tried any of the products that were in her line please let me know and let me know what your experiences were with her products i think that her products are really thoughtful i love the way the products are marketed i like the color schemes I think that it's so cute. Like, look at the packaging. Look how cute this is. Give it a try in the new year. Maybe you might like this product as much as I did. So with that said, I hope you have an amazing new year, you guys. It is 2023. Crazy, right? Last year, so many things happened. And now this year, who knows what's to come? What are you guys' New Year's? Um, do you guys even do New Year resolutions? I've seen a few videos on YouTube of people doing New Year's resolutions, but I think every day you should make a resolution for the next day or for the day that you are here, you know, because no day is really promised and things can happen and change in a blink of an eye. You would have never expected. So you do everything that you can while you have the moment to do it. Don't wait until a new year to say, maybe I'll do it. If you have a resolution, do it now. And even if you fold with those new year's resolutions that you had planned for 2023 starting in january if you find yourself in february or march and you still haven't really picked up on those resolutions don't tell yourself okay maybe next year or next month do it immediately right now if you can with that said i think that's all that i have for today i hope you have a good day or night wherever you are and i hope you have an amazing new year and peace out i'm out <laughs>